that roll. Thank you for your the credit. This is a retrospective review of uh, Doctor No, James Bond. Uh, I'm going to do all the a review of all the James Bond films. I've got them all. Obviously, apart from the latest one, because it's not been released yet. But, uh, yeah, this is uh, I thought start from the beginning. I watched it last night. Uh, just one second, and I'll tell you the details that you need to know. Right, just one second. Right, here we go. James Bond is a fictional character created by the novelist Ian Fleming in 1953. Bond is a British secret agent working for MI6 who also answers to his codename, 007. He has been portrayed on film by the actors Sean Connery, David Niven, George Lazenby, Roger Moore, Timothy Dalton, Pierce Brosnan, and Daniel Craig in 27 productions. All the films but two were made by Ian Productions. Ian now holds the full adaptation rights to all of Fleming's Bond novels. Well, there you go. How's that? Yeah. <clears throat> well, well, I watched Doctor No with Sean Connery, who is my favourite uh, James Bond of all time. And it's Bond. 007. Licensed to thrill. The name's Bond. 007. Licensed to thrill. Yeah. My little impression. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Uh, what did I think of it? Has it aged well? Uh. I have to say the Bond villain in it, uh, well, I think the Millennials would have an issue with the Bond villain, to be honest with you. Just one second. Just one second. Dr. No is a 1962 British spy film directed by Terence Young. It is based on the 1958 novel of the same name by Ian Fleming. Starring Sean Connery, Ursula Andress, Joseph Wiseman, and Jack Lord, it is the first film in the James Bond series and was adapted by Richard Maibaum, Johanna Harwood, and Berkeley Mather. The film was produced by Harry Saltzman and Albert R. Broccoli, a partnership that continued until 1975. Hey, see you now, hey? Just one second. Right, just one second. character and the main antagonist in the 1958 James Bond novel and its 1962 film adaptation Drive No, the first of the series, in which he was portrayed by Joseph Wiseman. Well, yeah, you played a good part, uh, and what have you, so, uh, but he was played by, uh, by, uh, Oh, Joseph Wiseman. Uh, anyway, what did I think of the film? Uh, to be honest with you, I thought it was... I think it stood up well. Uh, to be honest with you, uh, I think the sets were good. Where, where, where the film was good. Uh, it's the first time we see uh, Bond in the movies. Uh, in Doctor No, say, huh, James Bond, God Lord Stavon, you know. Uh, which is was a, a fantastic scene. Uh, I think the the villain is played uh, who Joseph Wiseman plays. He plays a good part. Julius Snow apparently uh, plays a really good part. <clears throat> I think uh, some uh, millennials would have a, an issue with the, the the villain in Doctor No, but you know uh, that's up to them, isn't it? You know. Uh, really, uh, but uh, it's a good film. Uh, the bomb music comes in every every now and again to get you going, get your heart beating. You know, uh, some great scenes in it. Uh, great scene with Spider. Uh, that there's some that they're trying to kill James Bond with, but he, he kills the spider. Great scene. Uh, yeah, the film uh, holds up well. Uh, I'm not going to give too much away because I don't want to give too much of the spoilers. But on the whole, uh, to me, because I'm reviewing all of them, I'm starting with, obviously, going in order. So for me, Doctor No is a 7 out of 10 here on my channel. J uh, James Higgins' uh, Open World. Uh, it's a 7 out of 10. 
Uh, I've got the special edition, which has got special features on it. It's a two disc edition. Uh, just one second. Yeah, that's it. Uh, James Bond, the Ultimate Edition, two disc DVD set. Uh, the PG. What you get in it? You get a little booklet. Uh, uh, in it, you get the two discs. There's lots of different versions of uh, of it. Single disc, two discs. I've got this edition for this Bond film. Uh, that's the back of it. If you read there, uh, you can focus in there. It will uh, tell you what the special features are on it. So if you if you pause that, you'll be able to see that. Yep. Yeah, uh, and it's region 2 uh, and yes it's a 7 out of 10 here on my channel James Higgins Open World it is uh, yes so uh, anyway uh, stay tuned uh, uh, because the next Bond film I'll be, be a retrospective be doing a retrospective review of is just one second it's Sean Connery as James Bond from Russia with Love which is a 1963 film. Doctor No was a 1962, so they didn't leave it long for the, the sequel. So uh, that's the next one. About I am actually going to watch him. I'm not going to do these reviews from memory, but I can't remember all the all of it. So I am actually watching every Bond, uh, just to be fair to you guys, to give you an accurate review, not just from memory from what actually watching it. Like I said, I watched that last night, so. Uh, the next one, I might even watch it tonight, I don't know yet, I'll see how I feel, because I've got to be in the mood for these things, so, but well, I am doing every Bond film uh, a review of, obviously I can't do the, the latest one, I'm hoping to bring it out on streaming on Amazon or, or something, I don't mind paying to watch it uh, on Amazon, you know, I'd even pay a fiver to watch the latest James Bond film, to be honest with you, because I'm a Bond fan, right, so anyway, I uh, hope you've enjoyed this retrospective review of Doctor No, and, uh, Look out for the next retrospective review from Russia We Love on James Higgins Open World, the channel of the future right now. Get in there. See you on the next one.